Ava Marie here for Sunday Gardener. I'm with Carrie Engel here at Valley View Farms. And I know it's winter time, but you're saying this is the time people start thinking about seeds and spring. Well, you've kind of put your garden outside the bed, so you're not really that okay. worried about it right now, but you're also chomping at the bit to get ready for spring. So down. the first thing is the seed catalogs just start arriving in the mail. And, and the I, seed catalog, explain this to me. Okay, so <laughs> you just get book after book of all this information. And, and I said, when I was a kid, it would be the Sears Robot okay. catalog you'd want yeah. for Christmas. Well, this is for gardeners. You're gonna just go through and choose what you want mark different things you'll get out your garden plot and decide what you're going to plant sometimes according to what you see in the seed catalog mm -hmm. and then you might order from the seed catalog or you might take the seed catalog and mark it up and go to your favorite garden center and go mm -hmm. well wait a minute i want to try this 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 do mm -hmm. you have it and you know i love that it's like your little wish up. list yep. okay and so this is a company that has really pretty artwork on the seed so it really could be a good gift at any time of year it really is nice a great it would have been a great stocking stuffer or something i like some of these this is a midnight garden mix so this is going to be you know again look at that artwork on i think it's beautiful uh, but it's primarily white flowers that you'll be able to see out on your deck mm -hmm. later on w with moonlight and starlight. Mm -hmm. It just sort of shows up so you can really enjoy time out there. And pollinators are always all the rage and more and more people are getting back into vegetables and mm -hmm. we have pepper crazies. Oh, okay. we, know, we know shop here. <laughs> hey, um. uh, yeah, hey, uh, the, you know, it, you can get them, I guess, whatever nice spice you want. You, you grow it yourself. <laughs> and I, I hate to admit it, I, I don't love vegetables. I mean, they're mm -hmm. okay, but I don't love them. But this is a way to sneak them into mm. my plate. So different they're sprouts, green, different okay. sprouts. So broccoli sprouts, sunflower micro sprouts. Micro greens, that sounds very they grow really. <laughs> yeah, does it? I'm growing micro <laughs> greens. Right. And they grow really <laughs> fast in your windowsill. You can just oh. cut them, put them in your salad, on your soup, on your sandwich, whatever and give I you that extra love that idea. antioxidant boost. Yeah. yeah, a good way to, like you're saying, grow some vegetables through the colder months indoors. Okay, so I know, again, this is winter, but this is the time to start thinking about getting seeds. Absolutely, seeds and some of your other supplies. So, you know, think mm -hmm. about lights and seed things and mm -hmm. uh, different, we were talking about oh, this. Carrie just wants to give a shout out. You gotta track the rain in your garden <laughs> right. to keep your plants alive. So exactly. now's a good time to stock up on things before the spring. Exactly. Okay, so rain gauge here, meteorologist approved. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on Sunday Gardener.